Hey kids! Welcome back to Mamsi TV. Sa araw na ito ay tatalakayin natin ang Identifying and Describing Triangles and Quadrilaterals para sa Math 4, Quarter 3, Week 3. Tara at samahan niyo ako sa talakayang ito. Ang ating objectives ay identifies and describes triangles according to sides and angles and identifies and describes quadrilaterals and its classifications. Let's study this. Triangles. Triangles are three-sided polygon. Triangles can be classified according to sides and angles. Kinds of triangles. First one is according to angles. So one, acute triangle. It has three acute angles measuring less than 90 degrees. So here is the example. So, where is the three acute angles? Here it is. The name of the triangle is triangle ABC or can be written as like this. Triangle ABC. Do right triangle. It has a right angle which measures 90 degrees. Example, so sa figure, narito ang right angle. So the name of the figure is, or the name of the triangle is, triangle LEA, or can be written as like this. Three, obtuse triangle. It has an obtuse angle which measures greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees. Example, so naan dito ang obtuse angle. So, the name of the triangle is triangle YSA or triangle YSA. Another kind of triangle is according to sides. So, ibig sabihin, disregard natin dito kahit maliit or malaki yung angle. Magfo-focus tayo sa side ng bawat figure. So, we have number one is equilateral triangle. It has three equal sides. Example figure is this. So, for example, yung side na BE ay measured na 5 cm. Ibig sabihin, ang measurement din ng side ng BN or ng side EN ay 5 cm din. So, the name of the triangle is triangle BEN. 2. Isosceles triangle. It has two equal sides. So, example. So, sa figure na ito, mayroong dalawang side na equal. So, ang dalawang side na equal dito ay ang side PE at ang side ng PT. Yung side ng ET ay mas maliit sa dalawang sides. So, the name of the triangle is Triangle PET. Three, Iskalin Triangle. It has no equal sides. So, ibig sabihin, lahat ng side na ito ay walang kapareho. So, magkakaiba ang kanilang measurement. So, example, 
to sa figure na ito, ang side DO ay mas mahaba sa side ng OG. At ang side ng DG ay mas maikli sa dalawang sides. So, the name of the triangle is Triangle DOG. Let's proceed to quadrilaterals. Quadrilaterals are four-sided polygon and it has four angles. It has classifications. Here are classifications of quadrilaterals. One square. All sides are equal and all angles are right angles. Here the example figure. So, ibig sabihin, ang lahat ng side na ito, or ang side 1, side 2, side 3, at side 4 ay equal or kung magkakaroon ng measurement, pare-parehas ang kanilang measurement. 2. Rectangle. Two opposite sides are equal and all four angles are right angles. So, example figure. So, ibig sabihin, dalawang sides are equal. So, let's have side 1 is equal to the other side. And then, yung nasa taas ay equal din siya sa side ng baba. 3. Rhombus. All four sides and two opposite angles are equal. So, almost the same lang din siya sa square since lahat ng sides ay equal or pare-parehas ang measurement. The difference lang is if sa square ay right angle, dito sa rhombus, it's either acute or obtuse angles. So, here is the given example figure. 4. Parallelogram Two opposite side and two opposite angles are equal. Example figure. So, dito sa figure na ito ay almost the same lang din siya sa rectangle since two opposite sides are equal. So, ito yung sides na yun. Na equal. So, side 1 is equal to side 2. Side 3 is equal to side 4. Ang difference lang ay ang kanya lang angles. If sa rectangle ay lahat right angle, dito sa parallelogram ay two opposite angles are equal. So, angle 1 is equivalent or equal to angle 2. While angle 3 is equal to angle 4. And 5. Trapezoid. It has only one pair of parallel sides. So, example figure. So, ibig sabihin, ang only one pair na parallel side ay ang side na ito. So, side 1 ay parallel siya or equal siya sa side na ito. Then, yung nasa taas ay iba ang measurement na itong side na ito at ang side sa ibaba ay iba din ang measurement. And kids, remember, triangles are three-sided polygon and it can be classified according to sides and angles. Quadrilaterals are four-sided polygon and its classifications are square, rectangle, rhombus, parallelogram, and trapezoid. That ends our discussion for today. Once again, I'm Mamsi and bye!